Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. I have another video for Shimmers Paints. And remember if you do place any orders on the Shimmers website, make sure you mention my name in the comments section at checkout and you will receive a free product. So I am beginning today with um, a cut file and I'm using the Simple Stories Winter Wonderland collection. It's absolutely beautiful. I had bought some of this collection, um, I think it was in December and I actually hadn't used it yet. So I know we're approaching spring, but <laughs> I, just went uh, back and uh, decided to scrapbook these winter photos because I still have a ton of photos to scrapbook from our, our winter vacations. So I use this cut file. It's a floral cut file and it's just like a squiggly um, or like a messy circle and then it's supposed to be a flower. I thought about using it as a flower but then I cut off the uh, stems and the leaves and I thought about maybe trying to reincorporate them into the layout, but I don't end up. I'll try a couple times because I really like those uh, stems, but I don't actually end up using them. So I was kind of in between. I didn't know whether to use the dark side of the circles because I love that dark brown paper with the white polka dots. And I love this blue paper too. So I was kind of in between. So I go kind of back and forth with this. So I decided to make a fun background with my Shimmers paints. That first color that I used is a colorings and it is called well blew me down and now i'm going to mix up two colorings this one is called my bleeding heart and this one is called mandarin mai tai and i'm going to blend them to try to kind of get that coral orange color from the collection because there's a pretty orange um color it's kind of like a i want to say like a burnt orange but not really <laughs> it's a really unique uh coral so I wanted to try to get that color and I don't exactly get that color but um, I tried <laughs> and it still looks good so it's all okay. Then I use this color. This one is called Blew Me Away and it's an aqua hues. And if you guys don't know, um, at the Shimmer Shop there is currently a huge sale on aqua hues. They are 50% off. So the aqua hues are like watercolors. So they have no shimmer but they are a watercolor so they're super fun. And I'm actually going to use two of them on this layout. I'll use a yellow one later on. But uh, yeah, the aqua hues are 50% off. So make sure you go to Shimmers and I will have them linked below. And check them out. And remember, if you do order anything, just mention my name at checkout in the comments section. And you'll receive a freebie with your order. So how awesome is that? 50% off plus a freebie. So make sure you go and check out Shimmers. And um, I'm just doing some splatters here with, um, I did them with the blue, well, Blue Me Down, which is the blue color I used first. And then I also used a coral uh, mist, which is called Caribbean Sunset. And uh, I used that as well. So I'm going to go ahead and work on my placement here and try to decide what I want to do. I thought I was going to have the circles kind of uh, going on a diagonal like that, um, like I had them a second ago, but I'm going to change my mind. So I'm just working on a few layers behind my photo. I'm just going to do a few simple layers here and uh, I decide to go with the darkest color which is that brown color um, in the background or directly behind my photo and I ripped the end at the bottom of the photo and I'm also going to use this orange color uh, paper which I also rip the bottom of it and then this fun paper in the bottom of the layers. So of course it's not a normal layout of mine if my ATG doesn't go crazy on me <laughs> I don't know what happened here <laughs> it just went crazy and I had to fix it so it only took a second so here I go trying to incorporate those leaves again because I love them <laughs> but they don't make it on and I just realized that I could have probably added them into my clusters once I was done but I didn't do it and it's okay it looks just fine without them so I'm just playing around with some of the ephemera and this is all ephemera from the same winter wonderland collection by simple stories and i'm just messing around with everything and everything is so cute i want to use everything <laughs> so yeah and i am scrapbooking a picture of my two boys this was on our trip this was last winter um so this was 2016 no 2015 and we went to utah and they were just playing in the snow so it's a cute picture of them playing in the snow and we are from florida so whenever we get to hang out in snow it's pretty exciting for us so <laughs> don't judge us <laughs> we like to enjoy the snow when we can because we don't ever get it here so uh yeah so i'm just messing around with some of the ephemera i did uh want to add foam to the back of my photo because i like 
the dimension that the foam adds so I'm just adding some fun foam to it and I will add it behind that little snowman as well and I'm going to decide to place those two squiggly circles uh, one on top of the other or or just like that as you can see there and I really like how that looks with the picture in the center it adds a really cool look and then I'm going to add foam on top of the circles so that the circles themselves could actually be raised up and have some dimension so I did that and and I really like how that turned out so I'm just gonna mess around here with some of the ephemera try to figure out what I want to do now this whole time I'm thinking I need another color in my background because as much as I love the mix of these two colors the blue and the coral I needed another color so I'm going to bring in this one. This is another aqua hues. It is called Pot of Gold. Now remember, once the aqua hues are sold, they're going to be discontinued. So that's why you can take advantage now and get them 50% off. Uh, so they will be discontinued. So if you ever um, want a recommendation, maybe on a color that you can use that is similar, just let me know and I'll let you know which one of the other colors is similar to this. But right now you can get them 50% off. So run, run, run <laughs> before they're gone. So I really like the addition of the yellow. I added it mainly in three areas and I really like how much it brightened up the page um, so much. Just the yellow is just a bright color, but um, it really made it, I think it really just finished it off nicely. So here I go adding it and I'm just adding a little bit of a darker uh, tint of it. So that's what I'm doing there. And I love the addition of that. I think it just really, really finished it off nicely. And I did some splatters, of course, uh, in all the colors. So splatters are always fun to do. And I hate that when you make a pretty background like this, it sometimes gets covered up with your photo and all this stuff. But I mean, that's part of it, I guess. But you can still see it peeking through the, the circles, which I love how it looks they're all peeking out I think I'm gonna have to add a little bit of blue there at the bottom right because there was no color behind that area and I don't know if I do it on camera or not but I think I don't so I do add a little bit of blue there at the bottom on the right hand side where the circles are to bring in some color and yeah so I'm just messing around here with all the ephemera once again trying to see what I want to do I decide to use this uh, word snow day from the ephemera pack to, uh, as my title so that it's going to be my title and I'm going to use a few stickers from the sticker sheet and I'm just using some foam behind those and so I decide to use the light blue side oh, here I am using another color <laughs> I just pulled out a ton of colors didn't I and what color is that let's see hmm that should be, I'm guessing that one is a creamies in the color Mike Clementine. Pretty sure that's what that one is. <laughs> um, yeah, so creamies Mike Clementine. It's like a pretty orangey, kind of a coral orange color. So yeah, I did some little splatters in that as well. And uh, I like how that looks. So I'm just layering some of the ephemera here, just about finished here. I don't add anything else to the background. I like it just the way that it is. And um, except for that blue, which I mentioned, I add there at the bottom. And again, I'm pretty sure I do that off camera. So yeah, I'm just about finished here. Oh no, there I go. I'm adding the blue. I did record it. <laughs> this is what happens when you record a video and then do not do the voiceover for some time. So. I did add some blue down there and yeah so I'm just looking through the stickers here I love these simple stories uh, sticker packs they have like six or eight sheets of stickers and you get tiny word stickers and you get phrase stickers and you get fonts so it's just really really great so I love that simple story is doing that now excited to add a little birdie up there on top and another little phrase sticker there and it says do you want to build a snowman which was perfect and then up there next to the birdie I'm gonna put another sticker that says frozen fun because it was freezing and again we're from Florida so we are not used to that freezing cold weather but it's nice to kind of um, enjoy it sometimes 
So all I'm doing here is just adding a little bit of foam behind the circles and I'm not going to be able to add it all the way around because the circles are too thin but I did need something to kind of hold them up a little bit. So yeah, that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have any questions or comments, please do leave them below. Remember to subscribe to my channel for more videos and make sure you check out Shimmer's Paints. Remember the uh, aqua hues are 50% off, so go and take advantage of that awesome sale. And mention my name in the comment section at checkout and you will get a free product. Thanks so much for stopping by today. Bye!